myself, Mr. S.K. Kulkarni, Assistant Professor Valchand Institute of Technology, Shalapur, am here to discuss with you on topic optimization techniques. Learning outcomes of the today's session are, at the end of the session, students will be able to explain optimization techniques and their uses. Let us see introduction. What is optimization, dear friends? Optimization is an act, process or methodology of making something such as a design system or decision as fully perfect, functional or effective as possible. So it is a process, it is an act or it is a methodology which makes uh, the perfect decisions, perfect designs, etc with minimum possible resources, remember. And uh, specifically the mathematical procedures such as finding the maximum of a function is involved in this. Linear optimization. It is well known that the two special classes of optimization problems, linear list squares and linear optimization problems have been widely used in a uh, number of application areas such as transportation, production planning, design, data fitting, etc. So what is the objective? In optimization of a design, the design objective could be simply to minimize the cost of production or to maximize the efficiency of a production. An optimization algorithm is a procedure which is executed iteratively by comparing various solutions by uh, or till an optimum or a satisfactory solution is found. Remember, optimum and satisfactory solution is uh, objective. Okay. Now, single objective optimization is an effective approach to achieve a best solution. So, there are two objectives or objectives can be classified into two, single objective optimization, multiple objective optimization. So, what is single objective optimization? It is an effective approach to achieve a best solution where a single objective is maximized or minimized. In comparison, multiple objective optimization can derive a set of non-dominated optimal solutions that provide understanding of the trade-offs between conflicting objectives. Now, optimization can be further divided into two categories, linear programming and quadratic programming. Remember, now optimization methods are used in many areas of study to find solutions that maximize or minimize some study parameters, which are those such as minimize costs in the production of a good or service, maximize profits, minimize raw materials in the development of a good or maximize production. So these are uh, the objectives in uh, any optimization. Okay, so minimize cost in the production of good or service, maximize profit, minimize raw material in the development of good or maximize production. Now there are three important elements involved in optimization. Every optimization problem has got these three components which are those an objective function, decision variables and constraints. So these three elements will always be met when we are dealing with optimization problems. When one talks about formulating an optimization problem, it means translating a real world problem into the mathematical equations and variables which comprise these three components. So these three components will invariably be met and those will be uh, used to get the solution. The optimization plays very important roles, especially in business because it helps to reduce costs that can lead to higher profits and to success in the competitive height. 
there are various optimization methods used classical ones or methods using soft computing so optimization is very important it plays important role in reducing the costs or increasing the profits and success in the uh, competitive world now an optimization problem is defined by four parts a set of decision variables an objective function bounds on the decision variables and constraints the formulation will look like this decision variables objective bounds and constraints now design optimization is an engineering design methodology using a mathematical formulation of a design problem to support selection of the optimal design among many alternatives so design optimization involves following stages which are those variables are there and describe the design alternatives so these are the stages in design optimization fem finite element tools optimization is also uh, one important uh, optimization now fem tools optimization is a toolbox for solving general and structural design optimization problems when combined with fem tools model updating it provides the unique possibility to perform design optimization on validated and updated finite element models so finite element models might be used in civil engineering as well as in mechanical engineering based on the acting loads the design constraints and the required structural behavior the optimal design parameters for the considered component or assembly are found considerably faster than conventional development methods using state of the art optimization techniques fem tools optimization has an virtually unlimited flexibility in the problem definition and offering the possibility to solve the optimization problem using your preferred finite element solver so dear students let, let us stop a while here here are few questions for you answer these questions state whether the following assertions are true or false this is the first one design optimization is an engineering design methodology using the analytical formulation of a design problem to support selection of the optimal design among many alternatives this is first assertion second one is every optimization problem has three components an objective function decision variables and constraints so dear students you have to check uh, whether these assertions are true or false write your answers neatly hope you have written the answers correctly let us check what are the answers assertion number 1 is false and second is true so what is uh, assumption number 1 design optimization is an engineering design methodology using a analytical here there should be mathematical analytical is the wrong word using a mathematical formulation of a design problem so this is a false assertion and second is correct no problem so these are the answers of the uh, questions these are the references for today's session thank you